now? I wanted to. <laughs> All right. All right. We'll do it. All so, right. is it Mike? And what's your name, brother? I'm Gusto. Gusto. All right. What's your name, sis? I'm Low. Low? All right. Just let me know when you're ready. We're going to do it. <laughs> All right. All right. Shalom. This is Priest Captain, not the Zach Nishah, here again. The Israelite School at UPK. We here interviewing a brother and a sister, asking them questions again about the same topics we had. Say your name one more time, brother. I'm Gusto. Gusto and Low. And sister named Low. All right. So we're going to start with you, brother. All right. Oh, really? We're going to start with you. All right. All right. So the first question that we're going to ask is. Are you familiar with the popular music scene that we have going on now with the popular artists? You got Lotto, you got Beyonce, Sexy Red, Rihanna, everybody popping on fire right now. Glorilla, you familiar with the music scene going on? And you as well, sister. Right? Oh, you know, it's sexy. All right. So we, we got one there. All right. So now here's the first question. What effect do you believe that their music is having on our people? You understand? I'm going to start. I'm going to come to you. I'm going to start. With you. Go ahead, um, I think it's a bit influenced, though. You feel me? It's like, nah, I don't even. All right, you good. But yeah, I feel like it's a bit influenced. It's changing a lot of things, like the way people think, the way people do things. You feel me? So it's like, music changing a lot of stuff right now. Okay. You said he feel like it's changing a lot of things. And now, uh, what about you, sister? I feel like... Sexy Red is a queen, and she's influencing all the bad girls, all the bad biddies to come out and express themselves. <laughs> I ain't want to say cuss word on camera, but yeah. It, More of the story is Sexy Red is a queen. All right. Honest answer. Honest answer. Honest answer. Okay. All right. Now, to follow up on what you said, what do you think makes her a queen in your eye? It's sexy. That's all. <laughs> Okay, for real, for real. Let me tell you something about Sexy Red. She herself. She's ghetto, and I love her. Mm -hmm. She herself. Be yourself. It's a lot of things in the ghetto. Every Everything in the ghetto ain't the same. You got the old lady that's cooking, that's taking Sexy care of people. Has influenced, has influenced these queens to come outside looking like Power Rangers. We got red, orange, pink. Thanks, Gusto. Why you put the camera on me? <laughs> she, she, she bought it. He, he, he working for me. We ass up front. So no sweat. And only the good side. It's only the good side. All right. So it, it's included. All right. So now, that's the first round. Okay. Now, you said you believe it's a positive influence. You believe it's a positive influence. I do think it's a positive influence because it's influenced everybody to be themselves. And they express yourself in any way you want to. Okay. That's a very interesting point. Now, what about you? How do you, you think? You got anything I need a question. I need a question again. All right. The question was, how do you feel the influence that the music wave, one of the artists in particular, the sister like, she says, Sexy Red, right? And she said they're influencing people to be themselves. Yeah, so it's, a, it's a bit influence and like good and bad, you feel me? So it's like you can either... Feel where she coming from, mm -hmm. from like where you coming from, or you could just be like, be yourself, like she was saying, like it's either or, like it's good or bad, like it's just how you how you come in and capitalize off it, like either way. So if you gonna be like, all right, I'm gonna do this and this, but don't got your shit together, mm -hmm. it's not right. But if you gonna do this and still got your shit together, and then you still doing what you doing, like it's all right, I'm with it. Okay. Honest answer. Appreciate it. Okay. Now, you said she encouraging people to be they self. Right? Yep. Okay. So, she's a fairly new artist. Just within like the last one or two years at the most. She's fairly new, right? You would say she's fairly new, right? Yes, but we can also relate to Nicki Minaj. Like, okay. Nicki Minaj is another person. She's a queen. Okay, now what about Rihanna and Beyonce? Because they've been doing it for a very long time, very successful. Cardi B is up and popping right now as well. Everybody like that. All right. But um, Beyonce, eh. She's the queen of the whole thing. Who do you think influenced Sexy Red to be live and, you know, be herself an individual? I'm going to say Megan Thee Stallion. No, Sexy Red is Lotto, herself. She's been Minaj. like this. She's been like that. Okay. And just herself, like. 
Okay. Yes, now, you also name people oh, that's and young. Sophie. Okay. Now, you still naming fairly young people. Nicki Minaj has been around for a decade and stuff. But Beyonce and Rihanna been performing. They was teenagers. You nah, see what I'm saying? They they just already got the game in the, like, okay. they already at this point. At a, right. They ain't so, got to worry about nothing else right now. But they've been at a position of influence for decades. Yeah. Beyonce is a different generation. We in a different generation right now. Right. And so. as an influence to take it further than the generation before her, the generation that come after seeing her influence and as far as she can go because she's one of the most successful artists ever. Then you get a Nicki Minaj, which takes a little bit further in a different direction. Then from under Nicki, just like you said, then you get Sexy Red and her influence. Right. So you believe that that is them encouraging people to be themselves. Right. Do you think that those people that I named? That that's them being themselves, like Beyonce and Rihanna yeah, and Cardi all, B. That's all, them being themselves. Yeah. Cardi B. I'm glad you said that. Cardi B famously said on one of her most award-winning songs, "I don't cook, I don't clean." But let me show you how I got this ring. Her husband, Offset, however, said that she lied and showed a video of her both cooking and cleaning yeah, in the house after a mess. Yeah, that's that's just like. Mm -hmm. That's just like how I was saying. You still got to have your shit together. Right. So if you don't got your shit together and then you just doing all that, that's a mess right there. But if you got your shit together and then you just doing whatever on the side, that's cool with me. Okay. That's fine with me. All right. Now you said being in the South is another thing. All right. So do you feel that these artists are being themselves? They always, they all themselves in each way. They have their own character, their own personality. They are themselves. Okay. 